Hi. In this video, I'm going to show you how to perform a regression analysis using JMP. Regression analysis is to find out the relationship between response and factors. Both response and factors are continuous type of data. In statistic, this is called correlation between response and factors. The simple would be one response to one factor. And more complex would be more than one factor. This correlation could be straightforward or complicated as show in these charts. Do you know that your JMP come with a library of data? Let take one of the data set for regression analysis. Go to Help tab. Select Sample Data Library. Scroll and find CAR 1993 data. Double click on it. OK, don't be scared by the amount of data. We are going to find out the correlation between car city mileage and engine size. So, these are the two data set that we are interested. Go to Analyze tab, select Fit Y by X. Put mileage to Y, response and engine size to X, factors. You'll see a chart showing relation between mileage and engine size. Now let's find out what are the good correlation formula. Let's start by looking as linear correlation. Click on the small red triangle. Select fit line. To find out how good is the correlation, we look at the summary of fit table. R squared define how good is the correlation. The value here is 0 0.50. This means their correlation is like 50%. Our square for perfect correlation is 1. The correlation formula is over here. Is there a better correlation formula? Let's try. Click on the red triangle again and select Fit Special. Over here JMP provides some standard option to transform your data. Let's try X transformation, reciprocal 1 slash X. And click OK. A new line will be added to the existing chart. Is the reciprocal transformation gave a better correlation? Looks like it's is. Our square value is now 0 0.70. It is important to know that the standard option of transformation given by JMP may not always gave satisfactory results. What you can do further is manually add a column with your transformation formula. To do this, add a new column. Click on Column Property and select Formula. It is right at the top. For example, you want to transform X to power of 3. CT Engine Size into the Formula stage. Click on X Power Y icon. Enter 3 over here. Now click Apply and then OK. Click OK again. Now go to your data table again. Now you can analyze the correlation again. Since you already transform your data, do a fit line analysis. If you transform your transformed data again for analysis, then you have transformed your data twice for the analysis. It is not recommended as it can become very complicated. That's all for regression analysis using JMP software. If you have question, drop them in the comment box. If you like the video, please subscribe and forward it to your friend that may find them useful. Thank you and have a good day.